Hello and welcome to Nigel's workbench. On the workbench today we have the Atari 2600 again. So let's uh, just replace the uh, rectifier. The rectifier. The voltage regulator rather. as well so we can just clear the holes up a little bit but I'm just uh, over these points up. recapping on this. So first one we're going to do is the 20, 2200 microfarad capacitor. So let's get this one off the board. Won't be too difficult. Off quite 
quite easy. Now I just need to clean up the uh, clean up the solder. Just get the old solder sucker on this and give this a bit of a tidy up. Now the, the one I've taken out is an axial one, but the one I've got is the other type. I think we should probably make it fit okay. So I need to put a capacitor in here. The original one went from there to there. So if you Look on the circuit board. Zoom in a bit on that. I'll get the right part. This is the positive where the original capacitor went, and that one's a negative. Well, I've gone through uh, with the meter, that point there, up to that point there, and it carries all the way along round to there, down there. So I've opened up the holes there and there, which will mean I can put in the smaller capacitor in that hole and it will still be connected the same way. One in just there, move it out, get the solder on it, so that should theory connect that one to that one. this uh, other capacitor and this one is a 4.7 microfarad and that's what we have here
Yep. Right. So, over. Regulator, five volts on that leg, nine volts on that leg. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Uh, buy me a coffee on Buy Me a Coffee or Coffee. Links are all in the description.